All right. Well, let's start this Monday off. Another uh, body weight workout. We go, like always, um, through three different groups, about two or three different exercises. So we go through legs, upper body, and core. So you know the story. So let's start with just some big, um, well, shoulder rolls. You can keep your arms down or you can really bring your arms up, which makes it a little bit harder. So it's up to you or just stay right here, bringing your shoulders really back, up, front, and down. All right, other side. And so yeah, every exercise is about 30 seconds to 45 seconds. Like you know the drill. All right, one more big roll. We're gonna come into a squat, bring your um, hands to the floor. As you come up, we're gonna bring them in a big circle overhead, back into that squat, other side. So a bit of a wider stance, knees come out. Toes come out, and as you come up, push up through the heels and really reach up and over. Yeah, breathe out right here as you come up. One more. Last one. All right. Stay in the squats. We'll do a few more, but we stand a little bit more narrow. So the toes come out more to the front, facing forward. We go slow. So just a couple seconds down and two seconds up. One, two, up, two. And you take it slow so you can really come all the way down and then squeeze up. So you squeeze up, meaning those glutes, right, right here. You squeeze them on your way up. Breathe in, out. Three more. Last two, chest up. One more. All right, big step forward. All right, we're gonna lunge down. And then move towards, kind of like turn, twist towards the knee that's in front and come back up, right? Here we go. Lunge, twist, and up. Lunge, twist, up. So you can keep your hands to the front, right here. Twist, or bring them out wide. Makes it a little harder. Lengthening, always makes it a bit harder. Three. Two, Oops. last one, perfect, other side, same thing, lunge down, twist towards the knee that's in front, here we go, all the way down, bring that knee to the floor, twist, find that balance, And then push up through the front heel. Three more. Breathe out in that twist. Last one. All right, wide stance here. We gotta get the inside of our legs ready. We'll be working on that for a little bit today. So lunge left to right. So actually focusing on the inner thigh today with a couple exercises. So get that ready. Chest, shoulders, shoulders down. All right, let's include the arms, big reach. Hips back. Three. Two, one. All right, couple more twists to get that upper back ready. I'll just stay right here. I'm gonna bring that elbow all the way back, left to right. Elbow back. Include that hip and your ankle. Good. 
Last one for the warm up before we start. Three, two, one. All right, first one, 25 seconds each leg. Simple, well, simple, but simple lunges with a pulse. So we're actually not gonna come up at all. If you can, you stay down, bringing that knee down to the floor. I'm gonna pulse here for 25 seconds. If at any time you feel it's too much, just come back up for a couple seconds, then back down for 25, okay? All right, 25 seconds on right and left. Here we go. So we're gonna to try to go through the different exercises a little bit more quicker. So they're not too complicated. So we can actually go through them quite quickly. Not a lot of breaks. We always do three rounds. We take a break after that third round is done. All right, three, two, switch. Other side. Pretty effective little exercise. Here we go. So you're really tall from your shoulders all the way down to the knee. Your chest stays up. You got a 90 degree in the front knee and in the back. Oh, I feel it already, Pat. Sorry. <laughs> you feel it more though, right here in the front of the leg rather than the back. That's that turn. All right, seconds to go. Three, two, one. Okay, shake it out a little bit. Gonna go into a wide stance. 30 seconds, quick side lunges, touching the toe. So, push your hips back, keep your chest up. Even when you reach for the toe, you keep your chest up. Reach, reach, reach. So again, we don't come up, we stay low. 30 seconds in three, two, Go, quick. Yeah, so try to keep that chest up as much as you can. At least not leaning forward. Yeah? So wide stance, toes out. Push your hips back. Keeping that knee over the toes. Meaning not go over the toes. Three, two, one. All right, come down right here. Different one, different exercise. To come onto your side, you can lay down, come all the way down, or come onto your elbow. Um, one foot comes in front, kind of where your knee is. I'm gonna lift the leg that's on the floor. Up and down, up and down. Yeah, 25 seconds on each side. All right, here we go, lift. So really the movement comes from the hip. Try to think about that, from the hip. So really working the inner thigh right here. Yeah, you can breathe here a little bit. Just breathe. And lift that leg up towards the ceiling. 30 seconds, 20, 30 seconds, and switch. Other side. So lengthen the bottom leg, top leg, over that leg, about where your knee is, and go. So lift. And again, you can sit here, leaning on that elbow, or come all the way down. Whatever's more comfortable, but again, think about the muscle we're trying to work and focus on that. Five seconds. Three, two, one. That's it for our first round. Easy. Let's we'll start right away with our second round. Big step forward. Pulses for about 25 seconds. Each leg, here we go. So pulses. Here we go. Up that chest. About halfway. Okay. 
Remember that 90 degrees. And pull with the knees. Three, two, switch. Right away, step back and go. Oh, you can do some arm circles while we're here. If you want, you can always add something. But really just focus on those pulses. The next group, we will move into more upper body. So for now, with legs, three, two, one. All right, wider stance. Toes out, knees out, hips pushed back, chest up, 30 seconds, quick touches, here we go. So try to get your heart rate up here. Reach for those toes, you don't have to touch them, just reach. Maybe keep your eyes to the front if that helps. Really lengthen that leg in that reach. Three, two, one. All right, come on down. One foot over that leg. I'm gonna lift that bottom leg for about 30 seconds. Here we go, up. And here you can also do your pulses, right? Always can make it a little bit harder if you want. Just keep that leg up there. Pulse, four, up and down. You can hover, bring it back up, and bring your foot all the way down. Three, two, one. It doesn't look like much, but you don't really focus on that inner thigh muscle right there a whole lot so <laughs> we will feel it here we go up no pain no gain oh well it shouldn't i guess hurt to be sore that's all right all right a few more seconds come on and then we're done with the second bell. Gets a little bit harder already. Three, two, one. All right, come back up. Third round. Stay strong. Come here. Shake it a little bit. After this third round, we will take a quick break. Yeah? Step back. Lunges. In three seconds. Two, one. That's it. So again, I'll just keep reminding you to keep that chest up, shoulders back and down, that bottom knee to the floor, and you're pushing up through that front heel. Your weight's in that front heel, right in the middle, really. But you should be able to wiggle those toes so you're not leaning forward. That knee is not over the toe. It's right above the ankle. That's it, switch. Big step back. And go. Something that looks so simple can be pretty hard in that third round. And you can feel it in both legs, really. All right, a few more seconds. Come up. Three, two, one. Shake it. All right, toe touches, wide stands. Push those hips back, chest up, and start reaching. Really just to get your heart rate up here, so be quick. You don't have to take all this time to reach for those heels. Just two words. And then really lengthen that leg. Push your hips back. Three, two, one. All right, so they're warmed up. Come on down. 
for the leg lifts. Bring that leg over and start lifting that leg right now. Here we go. So try not to lay back. I know there's this little sweet spot right here by the hip, but try to really lay on that hip, come all the way down on that hip. About 10 seconds. If you're not feeling this, again, little pulses at the top. Three, two, one. All right. Bring that foot over, all the way on your hip, and go. Yeah, all the way on that hip. Don't lean, don't fall back. And focus on bringing that leg up to the ceiling. Again, 10 seconds. Come on, little pulses at the top. Here we go. This is our last round. Three, two, one. Perfect. Well done. All right. So quick water break here before we go into that next next round. Um, we'll do a little combination. Like again, we'll do focus a little bit more on upper body here. Gonna do some push-ups, but really trying to target those triceps as well. So. If you come on into a plank position, you're gonna try to bring and keep our elbows really close to our rib cage as we bring our chest down. Yep. So not out like we normally do, but right, try to keep your elbows right next to the ribs and then push yourself back up. If that way we target a tricep as well, shoulders and chest, obviously. We do this for about 25 seconds. Then we come back up and we stay on our knees. We're gonna do an overhead row. So you can have fists or whatever, it doesn't matter. But your elbows come out to the side, reach all the way up overhead and all the way down, bringing those shoulder blades together. So overhead, down, overhead, down. Then we're gonna go back into those tricep push-ups, back on your knees after 25 seconds. And we're gonna do the same thing for chest to chest height right here. Really pull and push, okay? All right, that was your water break. Come on down to the floor. Get ready for those push-ups on your toes and on your knees. Up to you. Yeah, about, um, well, just a sec. About 25 seconds. And then a good 40 seconds with the next exercise. All right, in three, two, one. So. Chest to the floor. Elbows next to the ribs. Breathing out on your way up. Breathe in here, then up. Breathe out. Three, two, one. Come on your knees. All right. So try not to sit back. Yeah, use your core, stay up tall. About 30 to 40 seconds here. Fists, hands up, doesn't really matter. Elbows out, here we go. Reach and then back. All right. So not using any weights here. If you would have them right here, is where you could use them. But this is good too. You just gotta really think about Bringing those shoulders back here together, squeezing them. Bringing those arms overhead. Avoid bringing your shoulders up. Push your shoulders down. Shoulders and back. Last seconds. Three, two, one. Come back down, 20 to 25 seconds. Try some push-ups. All right, elbows, wrists in line. Here we go. 
elbows next to the ribs. here and then really pull squeeze and push yeah in that push you need to feel that right here the chest one more time and then we focus a little extra on core right we're combining lots of different exercises right here in those tricep push-ups and then the overhead and the press and pull all right so second round and last round for this one before we go into core all right come on down 25 seconds in three two what? Breathe through this one. Yeah, breathe in on your way down, then out on your way up. Three, two, one. On your knees, elbows out. Here we go, up up down and you go at your own pace there you go slow down but really try to reach all the way not half up and then back down feel those shoulder blades and your shoulders Last second. Three, two, one more. Good. All right, come on down again. For this push-ups, last 20, 25 seconds here. Then we're done with those. Yep. Hands, wrists, right underneath those shoulders. In three, two, one and go and again you try to get right into that normal one bring those elbows back make sure they're right next to your ribs not out Last seconds. Three, two, one. On your knees, elbows out. Core in tight. Here we go. Push and pull. Really strong. You can make a fist. And here as well. Shoulders down. Don't bring them up right here. Back and down. Pull. Push. A few seconds. Three. Two. One. All right, water break. Um, back to standing for this one. I'm going to do a standing um, move really for a core. 
a little bit more targeting those side ones, those side abs, those obliques. And also try to get a heart rate up here a little bit again. So feet, hip width apart, core in tight, and then bring those hands a chest height, just bring them together and then slightly back. Gonna bring that leg, your knee up across body towards your hands. So twist, twist. 25 seconds, 30 seconds on right and 30 on left. Yeah, so finish your, your drink, come back to standing, a little bit of a bend in the knees and we go in three, two, one. Again, try to be quick here. Try to keep that little bend in that standing leg and try to bring your knee across body. And you're twisting with that upper body as well. It's a quick tap with that foot right back up. So don't come all the way down on that foot. Quick tap. Three, two, one. Other side, right away. Here we go. Yeah, across the chest, all the way up. Quickly tap. Back up that knee. Three, two, one. All right, come on down. All right, now you sit and just hold, kind of sit back and hold that seam. Pose for a good 30 seconds, okay? So, the further you sit back, obviously the harder it is. Starting position, feet on the floor, hold back behind your legs and bring your shoulders back and down. So your back is straight. Starting position, bring your arms to the front. Make it harder by lifting your feet off the floor. All right, little pulses with the arms. 30 seconds, right here. And you pick your level. All right, hardest level for you, Pat. There we go. 30 seconds. Those shoulders again. Don't bring them up. Back and down. Keep your back straight. You feel all those muscles contracting right there. Last five, four, three, two, one. All right, roll over. 30 seconds, plank. Won't get into too much detail, but you know what to do. Elbows, knees, toes, hands. Just 30 seconds. Come on, get ready. Three, two, one. So you can keep your feet a bit closer. For a wider stance, up to you. I have no idea where I am. <laughs> at the time. Um, I think that's it. Three, two, one. Sure felt like 30 seconds. All right, coming back up. 30 seconds. But we have been working that upper body for quite a bit. So, um, second round, quick knee up. Yes, right away. Three, two, one. Get that twist in. Across the chest with that knee. And then twist that upper body. Bend in the knee in that standing leg. Three, two, one. 25 seconds. Next, here we go. Quick tap, back up. 
Five seconds. Three. Two. One. All right. Perfect. Come down. All right, then hold again. Start. Hold back right here. Arms to the front. 30 seconds. And go. Really bring those shoulders back and down. Come on. It's easy to start rounding. You're getting tired. Right? Don't. Push back. You're working those abs. That's where you want to feel it. 10. Breathe through it. Three. Two. One. Turn. Plank. Just 30 seconds. I'll count this time. Yeah, ready? And three, two, one. You can see yourself. Make sure you're not piking, you're not bringing your hips up or too low. Hold on. Okay. Yeah, we're halfway. Checking. Four, three, two, one. Okay. You know what? We'll do a quick stretch on your shoulders and then we go in our third round. Quick stretch. Sit back on those heels, arms overhead. Kind of stretch out those shoulders a little bit. All right. Quick sip on your way up to standing. We're already in the last round of our last group. Ha. Uh, time flies. And you're having so much fun. Right? Okay. So, arms up to the chest. I am. <laughs> Everything feels great, especially when you're done. Right? Lots of stretching to avoid lots of muscle ache. Okay, last round. Here we go. And water. Lots of water. That helps too throughout the day. Not just while you're working out. Now stay quick here. Quick tap up. And twist that upper body. Three, two, one. Shake it. Other side. And go. Keep that little bend in the knee, that standing leg, and then keep those elbows out and up. Don't bring them down. Up. Almost there. Twist. Three, two, one. Go on down. All right. One more time, then hold. Hold back. Elbows, arms, and shoulders back. And arms up. Here we go. Little pulses. Deep breaths. Get your back straight. Can you sit lower? Or come up more? Put your feet on the floor. Lots of options. All right. Three, two, one. All right. Last one. That 30 second plank. That's it. And you're done. Little stretch. All right. Still have to do that one though. So come on down. Any way you want, try to start in the hardest option that you choose, and then you can always come down into your knees and your elbows. All right, in three, two, 
What? And if you want, absolutely. Leg raises, shoulder taps, but just hold right here. Halfway. Five more seconds. Three, two, one, and that's it. All right, you know, those last 30 seconds, you think, oh, it's just 30 seconds, but I felt it. <laughs> and that's all we want. All right, quick um, stretch, but a good stretch. So, back in that plank, not for long, just to bring the knee underneath the chest and come on down onto those elbows if you can, or just keep your chest up right here. That's fine as well. The stretch really is for those glutes right here. So just for a couple seconds, stay right here. All right, come back into your plank, lift your hips. And then switch sides. There we go. And other leg just place there, really. Great deep stretch here. All right. Come to sitting. And bring your feet together, the soles of your feet. Try to bring your chest forward a little bit by bringing and really pushing your knees out with those elbows. Here we go. Push them out. Just sit here for a little bit. This is obviously for the inside. At least that's where you should feel it. Yeah, bringing the chest forward, but not rounding the shoulders. Your chest is still up and your back is straight. Pinching from the hip, not the shoulders. All right, come onto your knees. So, you can either choose to just reach for the toes with one hand, stretching the front of your leg, or you can bring that other hand there right as well. Chest this up. If you can, you can also bring that other leg forward for an even deeper stretch. And switch. So reach first. All right. Feel this really right at the front of your leg. And release. All right, arm across. Little upper back, shoulders here for a bit, and then we're almost done. Looking at the time, we'll take a few more minutes to stretch. Other side. All right, release. All right, for the back of the legs, we're gonna tuck our toes in. We come up to standing, keeping our hands towards the floor. Yes, so bring your hips up, hands to the floor, get a wider stance. So right here, you're feeling it in the back of your legs. That's what we're doing. So you can just hang here. Yeah, with that upper body, just hanging towards the floor. It's fine. Right hand up to the ceiling. Follow that hand with your eyes. Still feeling the back of your legs stretching. All right, switch, come back with that right hand, left hand up to the ceiling. Follow the hand with your eyes. Bring your hands back together, roll yourself up at last. All right, we'll just do a little extra for the studio on chest. Yeah, find your hands in the back, roll your shoulders, Back and down, here we go, chest is up, open your chest. So open that chest right here. 
Now you can lift your hands a little bit if you want, but really focus on this part, opening up that chest. Chin up, deep breath, and release. Ending with those two deep breaths in, come all the way down and up, inhale. And out. One last time. And out. And then thanks for joining. Well done, and I'll see you uh, back here on Wednesday.